Hey guys, my name is Hank Taylor, and today we'll be reading Wild Ideas, Let Nature Inspire Your Thinking by Ellen Kelsey. Wild Ideas by Ellen Kelsey. Problems are like sticker burrs. They poke, they pick, they nag. But sometimes problems spark marvelous ideas. Zip. Step outside. Look, if squirrels can learn to cross roads by watching people, what can they learn by watching squirrels? Look at this cute little squirrel right here, sitting on the girl's head. All around you, creatures seek solutions. Pigeons procrastinate, bees calculate, elephants innovate, bears keep counting. Look, this could be you here on the elephant's trunk, picking the lemons. What are, when orangutans feel puzzled, they stop and think. They plan, they weave safe places to rest. Lots of problems require you to hold tight, but not all of them. Sometimes you just need to leap. Make like gibbon, make like a gibbon and throw yourself into a new situation. When, when these animals want to make something happen, they try. They get frustrated, they try again, they invent tools, chimpanzees fold leaves in to spoon cold drinks of water. Sea otters balance rocks on their bellies, perfect for cracking crabs. A dozen humpback whales blow a fine net of bubbles to trap tasty fish. Pop, 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 gulp. Like you, a mimic octopus is the, a master to, of make-believe. Is that a deadly sea snake? A harmless flatfish? A poisonous lionfish parading its venom-tipped spines? Your turn to f you're, you turn to friends and family for support, and so do other animals. Ravens use gestures to offer ideas. Hyenas cooperate to help the hunt. Look at that girl riding the hyena. Killer whales rely on their mother's wisdom. Baboons get guidance from their dads. And when they're seeking a direction, dung beetles look to the heavens and steer by the Milky Way. Problems that need solving will always be part of life. Untame your imagination. Does this look like your imagination in the ocean? A world of wild ideas await. That's the end, friends. Thank you.